we each in our own fields, Bob as a physician, myself as a counselor, were really passionate and dedicated to ensuring agency and dignity in the lives of those for whom we cared. And when we met, we met because there was a person in our community who was looking for end of life option support. This was a person who knew that they wanted to explore with their physician what options were available to them for their end of life journey. And they had a really hard time finding counselors and doctors who would talk with them about what was possible. Empowered Endings is a, a collective. It includes a medical practice, the Empowered Endings Medical Group, which is dedicated to providing high-level, high-touch medical care for people who are dealing with complex and terminal illnesses, as well as supporting their families and loved ones through the process. We also have uh, the Empowered Endings Institute, which is an education and training platform for us to help bring more understanding and awareness about optimal end-of-life care to uh, healthcare providers as well as people in the community. And the Empowered Endings Foundation is a nonprofit which helps to provide financial support, additional education and resources for patients and families who are going through the end-of-life journey and it also provides bereavement support for people who have lost loved ones. With Empowered Endings, we're looking to build a new paradigm in business and in healthcare. So the principles by which we practice in our medical practice are those that ground our business and everything that we're building. And we would like for Empowered Endings not only to be a beacon in end-of-life care, but also to be recognized as a new way of building businesses and providing health care that is genuinely honoring of each person who is a part of the system. We'd really like to see the end-of-life journey humanized. Right now, end-of-life care is largely medical, clinical, often in hospital, with hospice at home, people can be in home, but even that care is has gaps. And we would like to see end-of-life care become more holistic and more human. One of the greatest joys that I have in being a leader of Empowered Endings is being able to, to bring together a team of really phenomenal, committed human beings with this shared vision and to offer them an opportunity to work in an environment that honors their magic.